So you remember my friend from the other day? I was with her in the mom cabin. Uh, I'm at her place right now because they're, she had to go to the hospital to, to get her support for the armor removed and nobody else could wash him. So I'm here dog watching right now, her little dog, because he's very little and, and precious and <laughs> they're possibly going to be strangers trampling around in here exchanging um, the windows in her apartment and in case they show up today, which they said they might, while she's gone, that just wouldn't really be good with that little dog. And I was highly amused as I entered this place because it makes sense to get things in plastic. And I knew they would. They, they, they suggested doing that, so she did. But it still looks a little bit like a slaughterhouse. On that table, we will put people. And when we got them, the gore will not be on the cupboards and it's just all over the room and then we have your suspicious black plastic bag just hanging from a chain from the ceiling that is slaughterhousey it is you you cannot deny that it's just that is ugh, that's creepy that's i'm sure there are body parts in there and here we have more plastic to wrap the body and it's like a mix of some sort of slaughter gore movie and the show Dexter and you know or a crime scene. I'm I'm starting to suspect maybe she wanted to kill me. Maybe all of the construction workers and all the old windows lying around is just a really elaborate con to get me here and she's gonna kill me. Don't kill me. I mean not because you're a killer because you saw me call you a killer on the internet. Just leave me alone! Just leave me alone! Leave me alone! Well, oh, fuck. I think you've done everything I can do.